Well, I got this old beat up F-15 that, uh, just showing you the intake here, the air intake, and, and like all these ducted fan airplanes, uh, it reminds me of flying my big gas-powered F-16 back in the day, the Byron one, when we did the movie Blue Thunder. There had to be a big cheater hole in the bottom of the plane to allow enough air for the fan to actually work good. Okay, and it, there wasn't enough through the intake on the front. So Bud Perry, a friend of mine, graphic artist, does work and stuff for me when we're doing stuff like that. We've been kicking around this idea of how about compressing like a jet engine does. This on the Phantoms, there's more than one stage of compression compresses the air. Well, on our ducted fan models, we've just got this one fan back in here that uh, is having to suck all that air and blow it out. How about if we give it a, a little compression? And how am I gonna do that? Well, I'm gonna add a second speed controller. And right here, I'm gonna add a vertical fan to blow and compress air into the main fan and see if there's any big difference. So let's give it a try. I'm gonna show you how I cut this open and we'll give it a shot. I'm going to put that fan right on the CG. Okay, this is the plan. I'm just going to put this uh, deflector on here. When the wind blows down, it'll blow it out the butt. And uh, what I've done is cut the hole on the top. Just going to stick this down in there like that. A little hot melt glue around the edges and we'll be good to go. Here's the setup, elevator, nose wheel, aileron, my switch up here will turn on the upper fan, and my main throttle will turn on this. So I have two choices here. So I will turn on this first. screaming. All right, let's go fly. Well, we got pretty heavy wind to try this today and it's uh, 32 degrees.
You can tell a difference? Oh man, it, it like has lip on top too. It like it must be sucking up a little bit or something from the middle. As soon as that motor came on, it went, it just was, it was back in trim. I was holding full up on it to fly it. As soon as I turned that motor on, it started lifting. So it must have put some low pressure here, which creates a vacuum and the plane wants to go up higher. <laughs> Okay, I've tilted the motor up. I'm gonna try it. Let's go do this drag race. Here we go. All right. Are you ready, sir? Ready. All right, I'm gonna take my first fan on. Well, please stay tuned because I'm going to do more experimenting with motors and batteries to find out the most efficient settings. Now that I know it works, thanks.